and welcome back to another video so i wanted to do a, a valentine's set and i'm just starting off with the madame glam base coat base coating all the tips which i already have buffed so yeah base coating them and curing for 30 seconds Then I go in with Madame Glam's Perfect Pink and look at this coverage and the color is so pretty. Love this color, but it's such a good coverage on it. I sped it up a bit because, yeah. Watching regular polishing is, we've all seen it thousands of times. <laughs> so yeah, I just, apply this color on all four tips then I am going in with the air puffing no cleanse matte uh, top coat I wiped off the tips first just to be sure I don't get any stickiness or anything in this top coat you need to i'm going to use the aero puffing and you need a matte surface so i am using their matte top coat this has no cleanse but i'm cleaning them afterwards anyway as you will see or wiping them um to be sure but yeah if you're using aero puffing it will not stick to a glossy surface so curing that for 30 seconds and you see I am just wiping them off just in case with some isopropyl alcohol and then I'm doing one nail at a time and I had kind of had a plan with this yeah you see I have my air puffing there um, I just take some scotch tape which isn't you know the tape isn't really strong and just clean to clean off any hair you know whatever uh, fluff which might be on it and I'm taking the regular white air puffing paint and a little goes a long way of course I'm not gonna do only one nail but yeah um, but I see that I have to I don't know figure out you know how much I have on the sponge and all of that I'm like yeah uh, I'm taking a hot stencil from Air Puffing. I wish, but I, I don't have any bigger hearts from them. I don't think they have bigger hearts. They have, I have other hearts from them, like in other, like more, you know, the more pointy ones and stuff like that. Looking a bit different, but what I'm doing now wasn't quite working so i had to you will see what i why i have to go in with this smallest heart again but yeah i'm just putting on those two stencils and then go in with the white paint and yeah i'm i mean this is it's so easy the air puffing is so easy right but at the same time getting used to like you know when you have too little on the on the sponge or too much it's like yeah so i was kind of dabbing way too long you know dabbing on it <laughs> for so long but yeah i guess it's something i will get more used to uh, and if you don't have air puffing and you want to do this uh you can buy you know one of this dibber dabber thing with a sponge on on aliexpress or whatever wherever you get it from um, it will not be the same as air puffing, but it's the same kind of thing, but it's not as good as this one, but that's, yeah, another thing. And, and you can use some um, stamping gel, you can use some painting, thick painting gels, some very, yeah, as long as they are very pigmented and on the thicker side. Um, so, yeah, you don't need air puffing, but it's absolutely nice and these paints are amazing they are so freaking 
a little goes such a long way and you can use them as paints you can use them as gel polish by just by um, adding some of the air puffing you no know, wipe top coat the glossy one makes it thinner and the matte one makes it thicker I'm just showing you a sticker album I found in a store here because I haven't um, bought the album from air puffing forgot about that to keep the stencils in so yeah I just bought this some of these and it's working just the same so you see I have to go in again with this heart because I didn't get the yeah you will see and get the white just around uh, where the big heart where it goes into the big heart to kind of get them apart and yeah I'm doing the same on the top but there I just take the biggest one first and I dab over like over the whole nail almost or over the whole top so when I go in with the smaller one it's kind of it has already that dark color so you can't see it that good so I should have done it this way but yeah um <laughs> this is the only nail I did this with because I was like no this didn't work good <laughs> it kind of did but I effed it up on this top one just sped it up a bit because it's exactly the same but I yeah I did a mistake by doing this I shouldn't have yeah by the way I'm taking out the pink it's a very dark pink so I'm just taking a tiny tiniest bit and take some white and I'm mixing it together to get a like yeah a pink but not a lighter pink than the pink is um, so yeah I shouldn't have dabbed that darker onto the left side you know I should have kept on the right side of the heart stencil on the of the tip where I am I'll sh <laughs> you'll see what I mean because when I I just have another uh, sponge that I've been using for some dark colors so you see there I shouldn't have gone over to the left I should have kept you know with myself at the right side and then cure that because you to cure in between that is something I forgot to say when before I put that little heart back again I cured it and when I take every time I take off a stencil I cure for 30 seconds and then I just put on a new one you see there when I put that on it's already like dark pink purplish under so it doesn't look good <laughs> I think there is it's because of the sponge I'm using even though I call it I cleaned it I think there is some purple sitting on it that didn't I didn't get cleaned off so yeah but that was a big mistake I did I should have done it the same way I did uh, further down with the white but hey ho it is what it is so that was that nail done here I've only placed some hearts in different sizes around the nail so you see there's just random and I'm just gonna do the same uh, with this as I did with the first one with the white down and the darker on the top so yeah I'll just let you watch and be back
here I'm going in with the out call outline the big stencil the outline so or I'm gonna fill in the I was feeling the outline of the hearts now I'm feeling the inside of the hearts gosh I can't explain uh, one thing I forgot to say is when you do when you use the stencils and always take the stencil off before you cure you know don't put it in the lamp with the stencil on so every time I take a stencil off I'm curing um, so yeah it's just the same I'm going in with the white in the bottom and the dark pink in the top so it's pretty repetitive I this did not turn out as I wanted it to or anything but yeah I thought well let's just go with it you know so yeah <laughs> it's uh, I feel like that's how it usually is I just think about something and no it doesn't turn out as I thought in my head you know but yeah it's a valentine set for sure it's hearts all over the place so I'm just gonna let you watch the rest and I'll be back at the end Okay guys, so here it is. I used the Madame Glam No White Top Coat. It did not turn out as I wanted them to, but still cute though. Still cute. Very Valentine. Hearts all over the place. Light is blinding a bit, I know, but yeah, I don't know if you like it like matte as it was before I top coated it or if you prefer it glossy. But yeah, that's it guys. I'm gonna have to practice a bit more on different things with this air puffing. It is easy, it is easy, but at the same time not if you wanna achieve different things, you know. But hey, that's it for today, guys. I hope you liked the video, and if you did, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel if you're not already, hit the notification bell, and click all so you can notify of all my future uploads, and hopefully I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.